right, this is uh, just a dumb video idea I had to uh, poison myself with alcohol. Um, so I'm going to uh, <laughs> work my way through a six pack of random beers in my fridge because I have a lot of them. I need to drink some <laughs> while I uh, work on uh, getting through this six pack of games here. Ah. Bust open this bottle here. This is uh, this is Blue Moon. It's not bad. Take a, take a little swig here. Uh, and set it down. Make some microphone noise there. All right, first game we're gonna play is Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's do this. Whoo! That chime is so great. It's so great that it takes up a third of the uh, memory of the ROM, from what I've heard. I read that in a book, so it must be true. Alright, let's hit the start button here. Right, return to game. It is not recognizing inputs. There we go. No real challenge here. Just uh, me getting progressively more drunk as I play these games. Um, I will conclude when either I am out of lives or when the beer is gone. Whichever comes first. Which, I'll probably run out of lives before the beer runs out. Let's face it, in a game like Sonic, I don't have a lot of time to stop and drink. Ah. <laughs> Come on, I'm not even drunk yet. What's going on here? Back up. Get this. Get this loop to loop going right here. Let's do this. Some people think Sonic's a bad game. They're wrong. Uh, special stages. The trick with these is to hug the walls as much as possible. Nope. Mm. Try not to hit those reverse things when they are going in the direction you want to go. Here we go. First Chaos Emerald. Maybe I'll finish that Blue Moon uh, quicker than I thought. Like I was saying, uh, Sonic's not a bad game. People just uh, don't get it, maybe? I don't know. Uh, it's not uh, not so much about speed as it is about... I mean, speed, yes, yeah, Sonic can run fast, but uh, you don't want to just run fast in this game because, well, you'll die. Uh, you can't just press the jump button constantly in Mario. Yeah, speed is just kind of what Sonic uses to uh, get past obstacles and explore. Case in point, build up some speed, you can get through that wall, get some secrets. That's what Sonic's all about. Oh. Maybe this wasn't a good idea, I'm just going to burp through this whole thing here. Go. 
Ah! I tried to go back for it. You can see my foot kind of poke out there. Didn't get it though. That's all right. We're not really playing to win today. <laughs> Funny thing about that, that'll actually crush you if, if you let it. Nothing worse than that, getting crushed by something that's supposed to help you. This is the part that most people, in videos uh, where people uh, rip on Sonic, this is the part that everyone gets pissed off about. Just, just jump over the damn spring. Come on, guys. It's not that hard. I always see that. People just run right into that spring and go, Oh, why would they put that there if they want me to run? because they want you to pay attention, you idiot. another little secret here boom yeah I know my way around Sonic <laughs> it's one of my favorite games although uh, his legacy has been tarnished the originals are still really good don't let anyone tell you different True story, um, in one of the original builds of the game, that ball that's swinging there was actually like a obstacle or something in the level, and you could actually walk around on it and roll it down hills and stuff. I guess they just decided to uh, make it his uh, weapon in this level instead. All right. Saved all of the little furry animals. See, that's what Sonic's all about. He's about saving, saving the animals. Mario, you know, he's just doing it for the princess, and he's just killing people left and right. But Sonic, Sonic's a liberator. He saves the day. Ah! See, there's... <laughs> I make it look easy, but those things will actually get you really bad. You're supposed to hit them in the head, but as you can see, the head doesn't make up much of the surface area on that spiny creature. Ah! See? You gotta hit him just right. There was some secrets down there I missed. That's all right. Woo. See, this is a level here. This, I mean, this whole level, uh, it's not about speed. This is more about just exploring these temples and solving puzzles like this one. Um, I don't, I just, this kind of stuff's fun to me. Especially when I was a kid trying to figure it all out for the first time. Didn't need that shield, but that is okay. Lots of fun little secrets in Sonic the Hedgehog, like this little room here. Isn't that nice? A lot of risk reward going on. This game's a lot of fun. Uh, that's gonna quish me. I don't want to do that. Gotta get the timing on this just right. I think this will be it. Here we go. And I think this is it. Nope. 
Nope, I was wrong. Oh! Okay. I thought for sure I had lost my rings there. But if I don't get my rings, I don't get the special stage. And if I don't get the special stage... Then Big Bubba comes out with his hose. And it's all over. Alright! Taking another drink here. We're almost done with the blue moon. Uh, so I think uh, I can beat this special stage. Yeah, like I said, hug the walls. Try to stay on the walls. Never let yourself free fall like I just did. Those reverse buttons are great. If you get them... Nope, we don't want to go there. Jesus, Louise. Okay, here we go. Look at that arrow. Isn't that... Isn't that nice of that arrow to tell me where to go? That's, uh... Some great game design there. Right? Right? Yeah. You got my back, random person on the internet who's watching this video. Probably in their underwear. Trying to figure out what kind of lunatic drinks beer and plays Sonic the Hedgehog. Mm. Alright, that's it for the Blue Moon. And uh, that means that's it for Sonic. So uh, we're going to move on to a new game and a new beer. And I will see you then.